Hi hello. I am Mr. John. Welcome to the session. I think this video will be very useful to you. Let's go to the video. But before that please do. Subscribe. And turn on the. Notification by clicking the bell icon. Blood. Blood is a fluid connective tissue. It circulates constantly around the body. Propelled by the pumping action of the heart. It transports. Oxygen. Nutrients. Hormones. Heat. Antibodies and cells of immune system. Clotting factors. Wastes. Blood is composed of clear straw color. Watery fluid called plasma. Plasma normally constitutes 55% of the volume of blood. And cell fraction 45%. Blood makes up about 7% of body weight nearly about. 5.6 liters in adult. The total blood volume in adults is about. 80 milliliter per kilogram body weight in males. And 70 milliliters per kilogram in females. Heat produced from metabolically active organs such as. Working skeletal muscles. And the liver is distributed around the body by the bloodstream maintaining core body temperature. There are three types of blood cells. They are. Erythrocytes. Which is also known as red blood cells. Leukocytes. Which is also known as white blood cells. Thrombocytes which is also known as platelets. Let us see about erythrocytes. This, this is the structure of erythrocytes. Red blood cells are by far the most abundant type of blood cell. 99% of all blood cells are erythrocytes. They are biconcave discs, with no nucleus, and the diameter is about 7 micrometers. Their main function is the transport of gas, mainly oxygen, but they also carry some carbon dioxide. Because they have no nucleus, erythrocytes cannot divide, and so need to be continuously replaced by new cells, from the red bone marrow, present in the ends of long bones, and in flat bones, and irregular bones. They pass through several stages of development, before entering the blood, their lifespan in the circulation, is about 120 days. The process of erythrocyte development, from stem cells takes about 7 days and is called erythropoiese. The immature cells are released into the bloodstream as reticulocytes, and mature into erythrocytes, over a few days within the circulation. During this time they lose their nucleus. Notes on white blood cells, and the platelets, given below in the description. You can take the notes by clicking the link in description. I hope that this video is useful to everyone. And please do subscribe my channel and turn on the notification by clicking the bell icon. For more notes, thank you.